Mounting troubles for North Carolina Lieutenant Governor Mark Robinson this morning. He's the GOP nominee for the state's gubernatorial race, but members of his own party want him to drop out. All of this following a report about comments he allegedly made on an adult website. Robinson, a social conservative who President Trump has touted as Martin Luther King on steroids, is said to have called himself a black Nazi and saying he would buy slaves. Robinson denies the claims, calling them, quote, tabloid trash. Dina Harley from our News Nation affiliate in Raleigh joins us live from the Capitol with more on this one. Dina Robinson has been very clear he is not quitting. Yeah, good, good morning. He has made it abundantly clear, posting a video on X saying that he is adamant that he is staying in the race. That video from him and those claims from him that he's staying in the race coming, despite even people from his own party calling him for calling for him to drop out of the race. All of this starting yesterday after that report from CNN about comments that Robinson allegedly made on a pornographic website, including, like you mentioned, calling himself a black Nazi, saying he would buy slaves, talking about watching women in the past. CBS 17 has not con independently confirmed those comments, and Robinson has denied that it was him, despite CNN tying the account to him in several different ways. So the big question today was, if he does drop out with his name still on the ballot, what happens? Today, we know that some ballots are going out to military members today. Under state law here, any votes for Robinson would then go to whoever the Republican Party replaces him with. But in that video posted to X that I mentioned, Robinson is insisting on staying in the race. Our opponents are desperate to shift the focus here from the substantive issues and focus on what you are concerned with to salacious tabloid trash. We cannot allow that to happen. Democratic Attorney General Josh Stein is running against Robinson for governor. His campaign responded to the article saying, quote, North Carolinians already know Mark Robinson is completely unfit to be governor, end quote. Now, like I mentioned, some of those ballots are already printed. They're being sent out today. We know those ballots are going to military members and some overseas voters. Marky, back to you. All right, Dina, thank you.